The Secretary of Veterans Affairs did not mince words about Devin Kelly's service in the Air Force. We spoke to David Shulkin yesterday at a VA medical facility in New York and asked about the role his agency might have played in preventing the shooting. Is there something that the VA could have done to help him? Well, he served in the Air Force, but he was dishonorably discharged. I do not consider him a veteran. I consider him a criminal. And while I don't know the motivation why anybody would do such a horrific act, um, and whether there was a component of mental illness, I consider this an evil man who would do what he did. The VA does not care for dishonorably discharged uh, people who have left the service. So he wouldn't have been able to seek mental health help at the VA? No. One of the first acts that I did as secretary is that I extended mental health services to those that were other than honorably discharged. But when you're dishonorably discharged, as this gentleman was, it's because you've committed a crime and really did something horrific. So we do not uh, take care of them in the VA system. And frankly, people who have worn the uniform don't want to be associated with people like that. And in our next hour, we're going to hear from Shulkin about why more veterans than ever are waiting for care. Plus, the only Obama administration holdover in the cabinet reflects on his relationship with President Trump.